We're here today as part of our investigation into water issues, both making sure that we have enough drinking water, but also that uh, we see that the River Thames is cleaned up and that there's not dirty things going into the river. And obviously the sewage treatment works here is very important for that, but there's 77 million litres of capacity in their storm tanks, which holds back uh, after a storm has happened and stops that flowing straight into the river. But we're also considering other things like the Tideway Tunnel, and we've also been talking about the Abingdon Reservoir. So we've been showing the London Assembly around uh, the elements of that process, ranging from the screening, where we get rid of the unflushables and the wet wipes from our, from our sewage up to 20 tonnes a day from Mogden, uh, right through to our sediment tanks, where we're getting the organics out of the sewage, but also to our aeration mains, where we're chemically cleaning up the, uh, the, uh, the sewage as well. Uh, it's been really critical, I think, to highlight the challenges, but also the opportunities of a site of this nature, ranging from our sort of power generation, which is up to sort of 44 gigawatt hours per year, uh, but invariably how we uh, treat the effluent to a standard that's good enough for the river uh, and to safeguard the environment and the River Thames, which is what we're here to do.